And here's where they they jumped the shark jumped the shark with a shark with freaking laser beams on the shark's head and it was eaten by an even bigger shark. The shark this <laughs> the shark the shark the fawns didn't jump the shark the shark jumped the fawns on this. The one. shark jumped the fawns. So this is the middle of the musical episode. Hey, uh, we have reacted to the whole thing in its entirety. That'll be probably on the channel for a little bit here. Uh, Star Trek is Las Star Trek is Las Vegas. <laughs> Star Trek is Las Vegas is coming on. Going on. Uh, do we need to speak to their manager about this? Here comes the. Here comes the. Oh, here comes the. Here it just here it comes. Here comes. Here it comes. <laughs> here it comes. It's not the only way you can set this up. Here so he's wearing comes. gold. He's a fan of our golden K knights. Here. here it comes. Here it comes. Why you? Wait, wait, wait. Am I in the way? I'm in the Fully way. Fully auto-tuned. Fully auto-tuned. Look, look, look. Fully calling us when you got your dramas. What? <laughs> oh Don't swear. God. Don't swear. Don't swear. Don't swear. <laughs> oh, no. Holy schmagoli. Sweet. Why are you calling us? We're Klingons. We need opera. Sweet. They boy banded the they turned the Klingons into finger bang. Sweet, <laughs> sweet baby Jesus. This is, this is hysterical. <laughs> no, this is funny for the wrong reasons. This is actually pretty really funny though. <laughs> but it was all for the, all the wrong reasons. I'm trying to... Look what they did to the I'm Klingons. I'm gonna finger bang bang you into my life. <laughs> Yeah, finger bang, that's when you get big guns in your fingers. I'm trying to calm down and not be angry. I'm trying to see, you know, Star Trek. The, the UFOs are here in Vegas right now, sort of, I'm hearing. Did you know? Did you know we have a ginormous freaking eyeball? Did you know? Did you know? I don't know if you knew. I don't think I see it anywhere. Uh, somewhere. No. Something's getting canceled. I'll leave you guys on screen here. They're going to finger bang bang into, the, into their <laughs> and the, lives. And the, and the Klingon. Look. Look. They're, the UFOs. And there was a giant light on top of a pyramid. <laughs> that's signaling them. And there's a giant. Eyeball. Looking at them. Eyeball that looks at you while you're golfing. Eh? So the Klingons. <laughs> also hockey in the desert. <laughs> plague, plague of what? What was the plague in Florida? Plague of something. Leprosy. Leprosy. Oh, we had locusts here. No, do we have? Uh, do we have? We do have locusts. We're actually. just we're just a couple <laughs> plagues short of, a, of an apocalypse. <laughs> we're a few horsemen short here. Apparently, I've been time traveling. We have locusts. Uh, we have a plague. Astral we, projection. We need fire. And we need, across the we universe. Need, we need uh, pestilence or whatever. <sighs> we need fire and famine. <laughs> oh, I can make that happen. The Klingons are singing and it's not opera. We'll slay you, we'll we slay you. you. We will slay you, we will slay you. We are Klingons. We will slay you, we will slay you. <laughs> oh no, oh no, oh no. I understand. I understand. It's a musical episode before. It's a musical Star Trek before again. What? There's only one reaction to this. Yeah, that. Yeah, <laughs> I'm exactly. Just like, huh? like, what huh? the hell am I watching? Wait, where, where, where am I? Let me, let me get rid of me here. <laughs> Your eternal torture is that? Huh? Huh? Oh, you can't see it. That's all right. Oh, uh, trust me. It's funny. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. They're doing the, they're dancing. They're oh, gosh. They're, they're, they're coordinated. I think there's something the Empire is not sharing with us. <laughs> look at, look at, look at. They're dancing for joy. <laughs> the end is not. The end is nigh! 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 There's hockey in the desert! The aliens are here! Klingons are singing in the point and the end is nigh!
Holy crap on a cracker. <laughs> oh, Spock was singing about his feelings, too. Did you see that? Yes. <laughs> it gets better. It gets better. Spock was singing about his feelings. Where was he singing about his feelings? La'an was, too. She basically... Oh, Nurse Chapel has a full-on one. We got La'an doing... Love, door, 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 door. She basically, I left Kirk in another dimension and I've been in love with him for 20 years and it's been on my mind forever. And here we are now. Or something, I don't know. <laughs> or something, I don't know. Oh, so they sometimes sing, but not all the time. They fly through like an acid ribbon or something. So sometimes, but it's also an improbability ribbon or something. So they rip off the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy 42, meaning of the universe, life, and everything. And I say the end is nigh. The Vulcans are singing about their feelings and spaceships. Oh, yes. When does he start singing? Oh, Nurse Chapel has Let's her show. full on. Her. All signs point to Brie. She has her little Brie Larson song. All signs point to yes. Yes. She has her little boy. Is... <laughs> Whoopsie. Shut up, Timmy. Look into my eyes. Look into my eyes. Don't look around the eyes. Look into the eyes. The following video is brought to you through the generous support of viewers like you. If you like this content, then please consider subscribing, liking, and sharing this video. And for those who are in the position to donate, this channel thanks you. And so does this orange cat. And here is the creme de la crap. <laughs> Spock. Spock is singing, but in a way that is new and completely different. <laughs> The bestest way ever. Hi, I'm Mecca. Please subscribe to this channel. I don't have a whole lot of time left. And you know what? We... <laughs> we gotta talk about Spock singing about his feelings now. Spock singing about his feelings. Don't make that mistake again. Spock is singing about his feelings. I cannot... St I cannot... I can't donate... I, I can't, can't not donate to the entertaining streak. Thank you so much, Face Rose. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Oh, you guys. You guys have no idea how much just having the support of sane people along the way. I went down the crazy path for a little bit because, you know, the end is nigh. And. <laughs> Excellent. Look what they did to Star Trek. Oh. And this all starts because, you know, you're like, why is Star Trek bad? And they're like, you're a racist. And I'm like, what? Spock is singing about his feelings. In this gothy emo song. Look at this. Here he goes. Where, where is he? I'm the ex. I'm her ex. Oh, he's crying about being dumped. <laughs> oh, my God. Spock is crying about being dumped. Nurse Trouble left me. And Jeffrey, the opposite of me, I can do. There he is. Oh, I'm so crying. I am crying. We have crying Vulcans, hockey in the desert, spaceships, aliens. Oh, and Laon is singing about the man that got. Away, Kirk. Captain Fartnacker. Captain Fartnacker is her uh, her shining star. Captain Kirk is her man that got away there, huh? Captain Kirk is her a uh, little <laughs> bit of her lucky her lucky star out there that got away, isn't she? She him here the he hit they, and she's crying about the man. I got away. Oh no! <laughs> we'll always have to walk on. Star Trek is dead, Jim. Thank you so much for being a channel member sponsor, however they still say it. It's, yeah, it's dead, Jim. Oh, my God. If you, you just.
You not only killed Star Trek, you dismembered its corpse. <laughs> And, and, threw, and, and fed it through a wood chipper. They <laughs> wood chippered it. Oh, what did they do? What did they do? What did they do to Star Trek? I don't know what they did by Star Trek. This is crazy. <laughs> oh, no. All sides for Freaking, to yeah. me. That's what that one is. What other songs were there in here? Is that the, that's the bulk of them. oh you got a lot between uh, a lot of stare down ones with Rebecca Romaine and connect to your crew. <laughs> oh, she does all the Gilbert and Sullivan type of singing. Yes. Oh, uh, so the whole point of the episode, they have to sing to to get out of this to, like, anomaly to, or whatever. The, yeah, to to break the cycle of the anomaly, they basically have to sing back at it or something. And the only people who could really sing are her, Laon. She has a song with Kirk. I wish they, they wouldn't put her in that um. makeup. <laughs> and this is what they did to my Star Trek. This is what they did to my Star Trek. How? How? Time she needs to change her paradigm. paradigm. My God, what is what happened? What happened? What happened to Star Trek? It used to be highbrow entertainment. <laughs> I don't know, but this this Star Trek convention is going on full circle this weekend, and that is what's going on this weekend. Star Trek Las Vegas. Will you see? Will you see? Will you see me? Probably not. Probably not. I will go to much more classier establishments, you know, where the 20-year-old hockey players hang out. It's deader, yeah, it's deader than Tasha Yar. <laughs> Star Trek is deader than Tasha Yar. I am Mecca. They hurting my Star Trek <laughs> bad for me, Daddy. My God. 